Welcome to Frost Astrophotography. We have kind of a blizzard here. We've gotten about 20 centimeters of snow today and we're expecting 70 centimeters in total if you can't trust the forecast. That means that you need to shovel snow all day and the snow also drifts around and into my observatory. I need to make sure that the observatory roof does not blow off and to keep my telescope away from the snow. I'm inside the observatory. The winds are blowing fairly strong. I'm fairly confident that nothing will happen in here with the roof, but I'm actually going to anchor the roof to the floor here with some ropes, just to be on the safe side. As you can see, we have some snow leaking in, and that's because we have a very strong wind and it somehow manages to find the small gaps that are present like up here for example Well, there's my blizzard protection. I've anchored a steel plate to the floor here and I've tightened this to hold the roof down. Even though I don't think it's necessary, there is not going to be a problem with this roof. It's so heavy, but better safe than sorry. I've covered my telescope with a blanket here, just to avoid the, the small pieces of snow. I've tried to cover up the holes in here and my hole uh, in the floor, but there are some snowflakes coming in from the small little holes that I have in front. You can see here that we have some snow that has escaped inside. Well, hopefully this will hold and back to shoveling outside. So I've managed to tie down the roof, even though it hasn't moved a bit. I'm fairly certain it will hold, but better safe than sorry, they say. I've been out with the snowblower now for the third time today and now I'm gonna rest. It's been snowing most of the night, but the snow is mixed with the rain, so it hasn't produced as much as we thought, but it's heavier to shovel. So this is the backyard. I prepared to have a mount here if I want to, but I haven't this year since I have the observatory. But I still clear out this patch. It's very windy. The snow blows, gathers in piles. The snow keeps falling down and it's very windy. As you can see, the observatory is almost covered in snow right now.
we have entered day number five in this blizzard and snowstorm. It's light snow today and according to forecasts uh, we're not expecting that much more snow but we still have a, a lot of snow to take care of. The height of the walls of snow from the snowplow is over one meter. So thank God we are not hand shoveling all of this snow. It is now the end of day five in this blizzard and the snow has finally stopped falling or almost stopped I would say. We have received a lot of snow, uh, a lot of wet snow and that means that it has been compacted. I don't know really the depth of the snow but I would say maybe 70, 80 centimeters of snow. I've been able to keep it away from my driveway and also from walkways using my snowblower and a regular, regular shovel. The observatory is still standing and I'm waiting for daytime to remove all of the snow from uh, the walls. I've cleared the back supports and I can operate the roof even though I still have the roof secured to the floor of the observatory. Thank you so much for watching this video and as always if you like it please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to my channel. If you want to support me and the work with these videos and the observatory there is an option listed in the video description. Until the next video I wish you have clear skies. Mm -hmm.